read uh, just a, a few excerpts from a resolution that had been passed unanimously by Chambers of Commerce throughout Butler County, and also just a, just a couple things, and I'll stay within the time limit uh, letter that I had written to the governor uh, a few months ago. The capital investment on this project, Sunco project, means at least 500 temporary construction jobs for 12 to 18 months and 75 permanent jobs throughout, throughout or for the region. Hundreds of vendors and thousands of jobs throughout this region have been dependent to various degrees in the steel making facility for over 100 years. The positive economic impact on an annual basis to Butler County from steel making in Middletown equals hundreds of millions of dollars. Suncoke Energy's coke making technology is the world standard for the Environmental Protection Agency. The Ohio EPA granted an air permit that in their words is, quote, a good permit that satisfies all the requirements of the Federal Clean Air Act and is protective of human health and environment, unquote. The caucus consists of Chambers of Commerce representing Monroe, Middletown, Trenton, Hamilton, Oxford, Fairfield, Westchester, and Liberty Township. And very briefly, from a letter that had been written to Governor Strickland a few months ago, a couple of months ago, AK Steel Corporation has been producing steel, a vital construction commodity for the United States in Middletown for over 100 years. This corporation, well noted for its innovative applications and superior quality products, has contracted to build a new state-of-the-art and environmentally friendly coke-making facility adjacent to its longtime uh, steel-making facility that will help keep steel production cost-competitive while supplying the steel plant with 25% of its electrical needs. <coughs> for real technology plus and energy capture and reuse. This Suncoat technology is the EPA standard for coke production. Critical jobs are at risk. <laughs>